Hi there, I'm Spades, and fire dancing has become a major part of my life. A flame was lit inside my soul several years ago that grew into a consuming fire of passion, prosperity, and self-insight. I spent the majority of the last five years immersing myself in the fire and flow community, absorbed by the warmth of their inviting light. When I sat down and made my first fire staff, I didn't know how important of a role it would play in my life. At first it was just a toy for my own backyard amusement and the occasional gathering of close friends. For over a year I practiced in isolation, unaware that there were even YouTube videos on the subject, let alone communities and gatherings where people shared skills and talents to help each other progress physically, mentally, and spiritually. When I first moved to Portland, Oregon, I sought out other fire dancers to meet people with a common interest. I soon learned that we not only had a similar interest for spinning things in circles and playing with fire, but we also carried similar social and spiritual beliefs somehow correlated with our passion for flow arts. By completely absorbing ourselves in the movements of fire dance, we were subconsciously studying patterns of flow and sacred geometry, linking our movements with the ancient mandalas used in almost every culture for meditation practices centuries ago. I became more and more addicted to the Zen state I would enter spinning staff and soon it started having profound effects on my personality and daily routine. It wasn't enough to experiment with flow on my own, so I built an ever-growing network of friends and people I now consider family who were interested in discussing these flow states and what we received personally from incorporating them into our lives. It might be hard to comprehend from an outside perspective, but by spinning a stick around, I taught myself advanced concepts of infinity, balance, self-control, gratitude, muscle memory, and the capacity for the human body. After progressing into the role of a performer and teacher, I learned how to be more aware of my actions and the weight they carried. I also learned about social perception and the difference between how people truly are and the idealized view we sometimes have for them while performing amazing feats. Flow festivals are an incubator for these concepts and allow participants to accomplish massive breakthroughs in very short periods of time. It is thrilling and inspiring to hold conversations with people you have idolized to find out they are normal humans just like you. This helps your own self-perception by leaps and bounds because suddenly the impossible becomes possible as you realize that you too can achieve greatness. Kinetic Fire is revered as one of these gatherings where the best minds in the industry come to mingle with everyone who holds a similar intent. Fire dancing has also helped me discover my love for teaching. Before I even felt confident enough to perform on stage, I volunteered at festivals to teach the basics of staff spinning. I realized you don't have to be the most talented performer to be an incredible teacher, and grew a passion for watching people's eyes light up when they learn something new. Since 2010, I've made it my mission to attend as many flow-oriented festivals as possible, whether teaching, performing, filming, or just enjoying the atmosphere. I've participated at every single Pacific Fire gathering and try to expand my reach every summer by attending gatherings further and further from my home base in Oregon. I've taught workshops up and down the West Coast, in Costa Rica, and recently in Thailand with Spark Circus. Teaching and performing in Thailand for three months was one of the most amazing things I've ever experienced. Flow arts are accessible to everyone no matter their social or economic status and promote confidence, balance, and having fun in a productive way. By showing kids how to spin a stick, I brought smiles, laughter, and joy to people living in very harsh conditions. I may have never found this joy inside myself if it wasn't for staff spinning. I attend dozens of festivals every year and even travel to foreign countries spreading my love for flow arts. So what does kinetic fire mean to me? Kinetic fire is an untapped source of inspiration, a pristine community of Jedis I haven't had the chance to meet face to face a continuation of geometrical beauty and wild self-expression birthed from flames. A new phoenix spreading its wings and rising from the fire. I want to jump on that phoenix and ride into a new sunset. I want to share my passion for contact staff, contact sword, dragon staff, double contact staff, triple contact staff, juggling and any other flow art contingent. I also want to be inspired by styles and techniques I wouldn't get the chance to experience on the west coast. I couldn't imagine a better way to kick off the 2013 festival season than raising a communal flame with new family members. I'm honored to be on the roster of incredible instructors at Kinetic Fire 2013, and I can't wait to share my secrets on contact staff with you. I've never been to Ohio before, and I'd like to do some exploring around the city before and after the gathering to dive deeper into the community. If you'd like to host me at your house for a night, or let me crash on your couch, get in touch. Otherwise, I'll see you at Kinetic Fire.